I, I told you that I would also show you how to take a large tree and bring it down. This here is a, about a 25 year old bear's lime. It produces just fantastic limes and you can see they're all out on this. My problem is now it's getting too tall for me. I can't get up and into there. So how do I bring down a tree? I've made the decision to bring this thing down so I don't just go in and make a big whack on the tree and start over. I think about it, um, what, what it is that I need to do and where I want to start at. So if you look at the bottom of my tree down in here, I let a lot of sucker, a lot of growth come out. I cut off a couple of branches that were that was in here moving up. So by cutting them off, letting some new uh, growth come up, and then cutting it so that I have new branching. So in here, I here was a little one, and I cut it, and I get I'm getting multiple, or getting more growth out of it. But you can see now, now I get to make the decision. Do I want to go back this low? Do I want to go here? Or do I want to come up to this level here? So I made some low cuts so that I could get growth in the tree. So that then when I come back, I make my decision. If I decide to cut off this fat right there, take the rest of it down, and that's where I start my tree out, growing out again, that's when I'll take my spreaders, move my stuff around, and I'm going to bring that tree bring this tree down again. I have that exact same situation with this Meyer lemon tree. It's not a huge tree, but it puts out a lot more lemons than I need. So I'm gonna be bringing this tree down also. I cut a branch down in here. I cut this branch off right there so that I could get a lot of growth. Once I had growth, I stumped it, now I've got multiple there. So this is struggling a little bit, but once I remove that center, then I can take this here and basically start over again. So I'm gonna be bringing all these trees down a little bit lower. So I'll show you later on, once I make these bigger cuts and we can see in here and I'll pick which uh, main branching that I wanna keep with, We'll put some spreaders, we'll put some weights on it, and we'll get it going exactly where we want it to be. Hopefully that shows you a little, a few ways of changing your trees, bringing them back down without just going in and making a big major whack on it. Uh, I have found that most of the time citrus does come back, but um, you can't always be 100% sure. And that's why I usually started off by, I took that one off and I took another branch over there so I have two sections, so now when I drop this stuff here off, I've already got a tree ready to go. Have a great day.